Kyler and Pastor Rick are right in front of me. We're talking about salvation. We're talking about Jesus. We're talking about practice. That's what I'm talking about. Not a game. What you talking about? Practice. I don't know a lot about golf. I don't know if you can tell. You can tell by your shoes you don't know anything about golf. What are those? They are my Crocs. We're back at it again. Back at it again with the white van. Remember that time where I threw you in the swimming pool? Yeah. We were so young and carefree. So young. Hey, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Rick built all this with his bare hands. Back out, back out. Yeah, that's a terrible idea. Get out of here. Hey, hey, hi. We're, Patrick used to used to be a professional golfer. Yeah, a long time ago. Do you think that we could show people today what salvation is? Explain it in in this video. I mean, that's a pretty big topic. That's not good. That's not. <laughs> I want you to remember this if you don't mind. Faith. F-A-I-T-H. When you think of the first letter F, I want you to I want you to understand salvation. There's forgiveness. It has to be involved in it. The Bible says the wages of sin is death, and that we've all fallen short of the glory of God. You have, and so have I. You can't earn it. You just have to accept this forgiveness. Uh, the next letter is the letter A. It's available to all of us, but it's not automatic. Some people can receive it, and then some people can reject it. What are you receiving? What do you accept? It's the fact that Jesus came to forgive you. Did we win? Well, they left me. They're all the way. F-A-I-T-H. I to me stands for it's impossible for you to take care of this on your own. You cannot earn it. The Bible says that grace, salvation, is a gift from God. And this is the hardest part because everybody wants to earn it. If I told you, if you walked on your knees from where you are right now, a hundred miles away and back, and that's how you would get saved, it would be easier for you to process that. Keep moving, Brock. That's it. That's it. Over just believing it and accepting it as a gift. Who's winning, Tyler or Rick? Cool. The golf ball. Should I hit one? Yeah, absolutely. Oh. T. Speaking of T's. Oh. T. T stands for turn. According to scripture, it's a word that means repent. Because he paid a price, uh, we get to turn and face a holy God. It's really the most amazing thing because it's like when you repent, and turn to God and confess with your mouth, it's like a reset of your life. Like a mulligan. That's like, like take another shot at it. <laughs> you keep it down! Hold it down. Hey, good shot. No lie, Pastor Rick just drove up over a curb and he high-sided a golf cart. Right. Touch. Pastor Rick, what happened here? You got it bottomed out there. <laughs> oh, good. So I need to put some weight down on this side. Yeah. There it is. Now we're out. You got it. I'm good. Alright. It's nice. Both time. That's there. That's good. <sighs> that was a good shot. That was a good shot. How no. often do you play? Never. This is my first time. Yeah, forgiveness. You, you're going to have to be forgiven. The A, it's available, but it's not automatic. The I, it's impossible for you to do it on your own. And then the T, you got to turn. He paid a huge price. What's your move? And then the H. Hey, Jesus. You've now met Jesus. <laughs> not hey. Happy. Not hey. Is so, it happiness? Okay. So what's your second guess? How about heaven? Is heaven in there at all? Is it? Is it here? No. H is heaven. Really, heaven is designed for eternity. It's designed for you. So I don't know where you are right now, but I just want to promise you that His grace is sufficient for you. That's what the scripture says. There's heaven for all of us, but none of us deserve it. But we all get to have it because He paid the price of grace. He loves you. He's just that good. I guarantee that won't come out. Sure, watch this. All day. My Kobe, first try. Nailed it! Nailed it! 
People talk about the sinner's prayer mm -hmm. all the time. Yeah. You've prayed for a lot of people. Yeah. And I know there's people that are watching that maybe they were on the fence, maybe they didn't know, maybe they haven't heard it explained. If you want Christ right now, maybe you've struggled, maybe, maybe you used to know Him, maybe you fell away from Him, maybe you've never made a decision for Him, but you, you sense this, this desire to serve Him with all of your heart. If you want Christ right now, just go ahead and agree with me in this prayer. I'm gonna close my eyes, I'm gonna say this prayer and you say it with me, because the Bible does say, confess with your mouth and believe in your heart. Let's pray. Lord, I thank you for anyone listening right now. We admit that we're sinners. We ask that you forgive us. We thank you for that old rugged cross that you, you died for us and you love us. And not only did you die, but three days later you rose from the dead so we could have a relationship with you. So God, please make us one of yours. From here on out, we want to serve you all the days of our life. And, and we thank you so much for your grace. We thank you for heaven. We thank you for a church. We thank you for the ability to worship. And most of all, we thank you that even though we don't deserve you, we can have you because you want us and you proved it right there on the cross. So from here on out, we're serving you. If you want us to get baptized after this, we'll do it. If you want us to be plugged into a local church wherever we live, we'll do it. But we're hungry for you. And now we're going to live for you the rest of our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. That's yeah. awesome. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. That was good. Appreciate it, guys. Thanks. Appreciate the way you guys love God. I know yeah. you have a blast on this, but I know it's all about the Lord for you. It is. It is. So keep that going. Don't mess it up, boys, like you do other things. You know, I just broke the marker. I don't really know what happened. It had a bolt in there, but that's on you, Neil. Gosh. I'll get it. Get it. Kobe. Kobe. Kobe! Kobe! First try. Nailed it! Jordan!